What is up, my bros? Today we are looking at... <laughs> Today we're looking at the Nendoroid Spongebob. You ready, kids? So I still can't believe we got this. We have a Nendoroid Spongebob. You actually, you know, pretty good. You know, the base... The basic Nendoroid, like, body structure, he's built, like... <clears throat> For the basic Nendoroid body structure, he's still basically built like Spongebob. There's no, like, no chibi-fying, I guess, maybe in the eyes. But, like, build-wise, um, he's basically built like himself. There's no, like, like shrinking anything, maybe... Maybe with the arms, maybe with the legs, I don't know. But he's actually pretty good. He's built off of the basic Nendoroid body structure. So his arms are using the Nendoroid peg system. And something I didn't realize, I didn't think, is that his legs are not. Apparently they're on a the ball joint. So... I guess because, really, there's not much to talk about with this being a Nendoroid and everything. But now, but with this being a Nendoroid and anything, with this being a Nendoroid and everything, with this being a Nendoroid and everything, he comes with a couple of accessories, so probably, let's get to the accessories. So, he comes with a little Gary. Just a Gary right there. He comes with... Several, by several I mean probably like four, four extra eyes. He comes with an extra face, a happy face. And the good thing about these eyes is they are on pegs. So, yeah. With the, the good thing about these eyes is they are on pegs. So, you can basically swap the eyes out from pushing from the back this actually wants to come now you can swap the eyes out from the back and the nice thing about these eyes is there's a little there's a little flat divot on one part of the eye so you know what side the eye goes to so that's <laughs> that's a little bit ridiculous a little bit funny so there is his face parts, like most Nendoroids come with. <clears throat> he then comes with his crusty crab hat. The, the way that you can put that on is you separate him at the face a little bit. And then, well, I, I don't know how the hat goes. Push that in. There you go. He's got his, his little uh, crusty crab hat on. And then he comes with two, two bent arms with extra fists, hands, one bent leg. I was kind of, I kind of wish he came with an extra bent leg. He comes with a spatula and... He also, I forgot to mention, he comes with, I guess, I don't know why Spongebob needs fists, but he has, he has two fists. I don't know why he needs Spongebob to throw hands, but all right. He has a thumbs up hand, and he has a Krabby Patty. But it's kind of, it's cute. <clears throat> so, let's just, uh, oh, that I went there just swap some stuff around so I can show you what that looks like. And there we have him right after he just made the best Krabby Patty in town. Spongebob holding his Krabby Patty in his crusty crab uniform. <laughs> I, just, I can't take this seriously. It's it's fun but like in a stupid way. I, I, can't, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> this is just really funny. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do another um, change just to show you. I, I'll do it on camera, so I can show you how the whole thing works.
So, I, I'm stupid, I just realized what the fists are for. Let's just take his face off. Get some fuel there. Not sure if nightmare fuel, but let's see here. It's like the port on this one is like really, it's kind of tight. And honestly, you know, the, the very cutesy face with the, I mean, I don't like guess cutesy face, the cutesy eyes with the um, big wide open mouth. I'm going to be honest, that, that's pretty much in character for Spongebob anyway, so I, I don't know what to tell you there. There we have him. Hmm, he's not standing. I guess what I could do is put him on a stand. There he is on a stand. I'm going to need the stand for what's coming up next. His feet are on the same system as his arms. Because they're all just kind of balls and pegs and everything, I guess. So now, I think it's a reference to him just, you know, running in place, being like, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. I just, seriously, I, I, I still can't believe that, I can't believe that this is a thing. It's, like, stupid in a fun way. If you like Spongebob, I, yeah, just get it, man. It's, it, this is funny. <laughs> And because Nendoroids run pretty small, <laughs> I'll show you the closest thing I have. I only have like six for specific characters. So here's a <laughs> here's Nendoroid Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> this is mine and my wife's. Hey, I want to get it for her because I thought it was cute. <laughs> He's a Nickelodeon character. I'm gonna set him off a little bit further to the side for scale. <laughs> Since he's a Nickelodeon character, here we have SH Figure Arts Michelangelo. <laughs> I can't, I'm, I'm telling you, I can't take this seriously. It's really funny. <clears throat> it's really good. The Spimbo, really good. And that, bros, is my look at the Nendoroid SpongeBob. <laughs> Seriously, this is this, this is a great this is a great Nendoroid. I only have like six, and the, the, it's a great figure. If you want to get it, you can get it. I believe it's still on Hobby Link Japan, so definitely check it out if you can. Um, link in the description below. I have Instagram, Twitter. I have Threads now, so you can check me out on Threads as well, and um, <laughs> on TikTok. And let me know if you want me to review anything else. Let me know if I, ha I have like a crap ton of figures back here. D let me know if you want me to review old figures or new figures. And just let me know what you want me to do. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Are you feeling it now, Mr. Caboose?